here with another session of fitness tips and fitness vocabulary. All right, today we're going through the three S's, spot, spotter, and squeeze. So, what's spotting? Um, a spot is when you're helping somebody up and protecting them during an exercise. So just saying, if I'm working out and I'm doing a bench press, and I'm doing a lot of weight, I'm not sure if I can clear it, then I would ask somebody for a spot. So they would come up behind me, and they would make sure that the bar doesn't fall on my face. So essentially, they're protecting you. Um, just in case if you mess up during your exercise, if you're not sure you're going to clear movement, they can pull the weight up at the last minute uh, just to help guide you. So it's really important if you're dealing with a lot of weight in certain exercises uh, that you get a spotter. So a spotter is basically the person that spots you. So the words go together, spot and spotter. Um, spotting is that action of protecting someone during that movement, and a spotter is a person who does that action. Finally, we're looking at the word squeeze. Um, a lot of times, your spotter will tell you, hey man, squeeze at the end of a movement. That's when you're really tightening your muscles, you're contracting, you're burning. Um, that's when you're expending the most amount of energy, exhibiting the most amount of growth. So, doing my bench press, I have my spotter spotting me. I go down, I'm about to finish my motion, he says squeeze at the top, squeeze it out, and then you complete the movement. Alright guys, one quick tip as well, when you choose your spotter, make sure you tell them to focus and to pay attention. So that means no checking out girls in the gym, no looking at uh, you know, other people, they're focusing, they're helping you, make sure they pay attention. Alright guys, another session of fitness tips, remember to follow me on Wiggle and Instagram, and tell me, do you have a good spotter? Jago.